Hey, to connect your Sony Aldware headphones into two devices at the same time, first of all, you have to just connect them to your first device and it's actually highly recommended to use with the smartphone or the tablet and get the Sony headphones application. So this is actually the icon of the app that you have to find in the Play Store. Let me quickly show you. You have to go for the search and input this phrase Sony headphones. There we go. So that's actually how this icon looks and that's the full name of the application. When you're connected with your headphones, your phone and the application, you have to go for the system and then tap on this icon to connect to two devices at the same time. So click on the switcher. Now we have to click OK. Now our device will be turn it off and turn it on, so we have to just wait for it. And this time also we lost the LDAC audio codec. So it will actually switch the Bluetooth connection into the stable connection instead of the instead of the high quality sound. And as you can see from this, when you are on the status, we can click here. And now as you can see, uh, we can connect this device into the second one. So here I have already paired devices, but I'm going to show you uh, step by step. So now uh, we just have to grab this second device. We have to go into the settings, go to the Bluetooth. I'm going to get rid of this connection. There we go. And now uh, we have to just click here. And now on our second device, we can find our headphones on the list. So we have to select them. And after a few moments, we will be connected. There we go. And now, as you can see, I'm connected with my Realme Note 50 and my iPhone. And now if I want to change connection, I have to choose second device. And now the speaker icon gives us information what uh, kind of device is currently connected. So it's really useful uh, when, for example, you are using your TV and your headphones often. So, you know, reaching the Bluetooth settings in the TV, it actually takes some time. If you actually navigate with your remote controller, it is, it's just much easier to switch right here by selecting this device. So, yeah, this is it for this video. Right now, please subscribe to my channel and see you in the next one.